Bet you thought this series was over, didn't ya? Welcome back, everybody, to Let's Play fools. Shovel Knight, Shovel of Hope. And uh, with me, as always, is my co-host, Kyle. How you doing? I'm doing great. Hello, doing everyone. Doing great. Yeah. Doing good. Oh, uh, this is... Yeah. We have I'm not some, just uh, doing great. I'm doing grape. Grape? Hmm. We have some uh, unfinished business, if you will, and we're not going to be doing it with this profile. We're actually going to be doing it with the uh, previous LP Great Boy profile, which I will let Kyle explain because I'm going to butcher, <laughs> basically. Uh, we actually tried to do this episode a couple days ago, just after we finished up the last For Fun and Profit episode, or For Fun and Profit Direct episode. But the recording was a bit messed up, and we didn't realize we couldn't redo what we're showing today, so... We're, uh -huh. we're using the original Let's Play profile, which we didn't get to show, like, any of it, because... Because it fucked up, too. I messed uh -huh. up the recording, kind of like what we're doing now. But basically, for those unaware, we talked multiple times throughout the series about doing some of the DLC, but we weren't sure what was on the PC version in particular. Well, Kyle looked it up, and turns out you can do a little something-something. Yeah! Yeah! And all you have to do um, to get to it is go through the Hall of Champions and hit that block down here. Ooh. And here's a map. What could you be? Exactly. A curious map. A map with a weird symbol. And there are some extra markings here. Kind of looks like a certain rare franchise logo. Hmm. Couldn't tell you which one exactly. I Me mean, neither. It's, it's a little vague. A little vague. A little unaware. <laughs> Don't play a whole lot of NES games. We're <laughs> full of shit. <laughs> We've done this whole thing already, alright? Like, look. <laughs> Had it worked the first time, it would have been a great bonus episode. Everybody would have been happy. But no. We always gotta have PC issues, so. Oh, yeah. Doing it for the second time today, which hopefully means that rather than getting a 30 minute episode, it'll be more of a, a standard length. But we'll see. <laughs> I'm not making any promises. <laughs> what he says is that hopefully we will not suck. <laughs> You never know. You never know. Ooh, mysterious area. Let's do it. I'm ready. How about you? I'm 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 pumped. I'm pumped for the wrong reasons, but I'm pumped. He was born ready. Look at that ship. Look how great that ship looks. Oh that my gosh! Good. It's the Battletoads. What are they doing here? Oh no! <laughs> Surprise! <laughs> We're doing the Battletoads DLC, and uh, Kyle's gonna be doing the voices. Good luck. Hey, Pimple, I thought we were just going out for a burger and flies. Ew. What's that crazy... Where'd that crazy space warp take us? Whoa, Rash, get a load of that shovel, dude. Er, uh, greetings, amphibians. I'm Shovel Knight, on my quest to defeat the Enchantress. Well, that's a neat story. Anyway, we're the Battletoads. Yeah. Branding. I also cannot keep these people s separate in my head. They look very similar. <laughs> Uh, wait a minute, Zitz. Is this guy talking about the qu Dark Queen bros? Let me at her. <laughs> hmm. I suppose one might think of her as a Dark Queen of sorts. Hmm. <laughs> well, let me tell you, we know a thing or two about fighting Dark Queens, and he just turned into New York. <laughs> <laughs> it fits. I, it fits a little bit. Uh, and no offense, Tapple, but you look like you could use some help. How about we give you some training, Battletoad style? I love and there's a terrible pun. I love the options. No? They're totally. Totally! <laughs> totally. Uh, <laughs> Gotta go for it. Did you hear that, Toads? He said yes! Uh, begrudgingly. <laughs> Righteous. Alright, let's hop to it. What the fuck was that accent? <laughs> now you're British? <laughs> now you're British, Toads? Look at that pose. That's great. Oh boy, let the madness begin. <laughs> let the yeah, madness pretty much. begin. And we're doing this shit. Yeah. So. It's like some stage two b battle toads. When Kyle originally told me, hey, there's some battle toads DLC we gotta do, I'm like, okay. I thought it would be like a simple stage and maybe a boss fight. <laughs> right, some nice, simple, to the point. Meanwhile, the people over at Yacht Club went above and beyond with the references uh, yeah, here. Yeah, <laughs> Which Trust means me, we're going to be gets, here a while. <laughs> it gets... I'm not sure if it gets better or if it gets worse. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. 
But this uh, but, whole sequence is a reference to one of the earlier levels, I believe. Level I've, 2. Yeah. I've not played much Battletoads, so you'll have to excuse my knowledge. I'm on terrible it. at it. <laughs> yeah. It's one of those hard NES games I don't touch with the 10 foot pole. <laughs> and this is one of the hardest. I think only beaten out by Ghosts and Goblins in terms of games that are both hard and good. Yeah, sure. Because there's a lot of stupid hard games that were. <laughs> That, aren't that nobody cares to give a shit about anymore. Right. But as it turns out, Battletoads is not the only um, thread that we have le that we left dangling during our playthrough of this game. Ooh. What else? Yes. Um. Well, you remember <laughs> Amazon Fire TV Gaming? Yes. <laughs> I have actually had the opportunity to indulge. Oh no. <laughs> I'm ready first for off, this. First off, some games require the use of a controller, like Sonic or Shovel Knight. That's Final good. Fantasy IV does not, but it's also fifteen dollars, so I didn't buy. So I didn't buy that. Hmm. Or any of these. I just looked at the controller ratings. What was for free on there was interesting. Mobile you know games. how you play a yeah. <laughs> but you know how you play a mobile game, and sometimes you're like, this would be much better if I had a controller of some description. Right. The Amazon Fire TV remote actually works pretty well as a controller for mobile games. Wow, really? Wow. Yeah. Okay. The only... it There's also not much lag, and overall it actually plays much better than you would think. Hmm. The only issue is that the stick itself some, sometimes messes up. What do you mean by that? <laughs> exactly, you'll have to er, explain. <laughs> uh, sometimes it, like, disconnects to the Amazon... To Amazon or oh I see um Some yeah for example issues, I see yeah and that might just be where I live or the weather that was going on at the time but the, like gameplay so. looks good you're able to you're able to yeah decently play it that's fascinating yeah interesting hey we like beat if a you actually if you actually want to play mobile games play them on Amazon Fire hmm. and now for hell <laughs> <laughs> you thought oh a simple boss fight just a nice little homage little yeah. did you know that they were going to include the goddamn Turbo Tunnel. One of the most infamously hard and bullshit sections in any video game ever. Now we get, like, the Shovel Knight version of it. Oh, no. I already hate this. I think he left. I think he left. Okay. <sighs> Heavy breathing. And now this shit. Yeah, sorry. I get Someone knocked on my door. Um... Now this shit. <laughs> but yeah, when we first did this, Aiden cried. I did. I'm like, there's no way they were actually going to include it. And Yacht Club was like, yeah. oh boy, I got you covered. We, we thought a little boss fight shit. against the Turbo Tunnel style boss, neat. And then we'll move on to another stage, like the Rat Race or something. Because they would. Mm -hmm. um, but no, this this goes for a bit. This is the majority of, of the whole the whole fight, essentially. Is the fucking Turbo Tunnel. It's just this. It's just memorizing the spots that come up. And it's not it even mostly a boss. They insanely fast. Turbo tunnel. And yes, it does instant kill. Yep. Fortunately, we have infinite continues, which is nice. And the checkpoints mean that you don't have to go you too just far. You dodged back. into a wall. <laughs> <laughs> I bobbed and weaved into a wall. Yeah, most of the checkpoints in this are turbo tunnel. Yeah. They do make it bearable, but still, like, you gotta be fucking ready for this shit. I was caught off guard when we did it the first time, because it was like 4 a.m., basically. Some like 2 or 3, yeah. And I, my reflexes were just not there, so. Yeah, and we spent the whole time talking about Smash Brothers beforehand, so. <laughs> and how Piranha Plant is the best new character. My brain still has not properly processed that. It has been, like, almost a week. And or, neither is mine. And I, it's I, been five days. It's it's quite a piranha plant of all things. I mean, like I, I guess it makes sense because like out of all the Mario enemies, I guess piranha plant you could make a move set out of. But like, it's, yeah, <laughs> it's it still doesn't feel right <laughs> half the time. It's a little odd. <laughs> we got a game with like Ridley, Ganondorf, fucking DDD, and here just piranha plant just sitting there. Yeah, I don't know where. and he bitch slapped Mario. I mean, to be fair, free. actually, yeah, and for a limited time at least, right. and probably even when he's not free, it ain't gonna be that expensive. Um, In case you're but, wondering, those guys do one hit kill you too. Then it yes, <laughs> we t we wound up testing it. Um, oh God, no! Oh! Fuck. I'm doing better though. Uh, That's the good thing. I'm doing yeah. better. I mean, 
One thing I do like about the Piranha Plant edition is that he does open up more avenues for what a Smash Brothers character can be. Sure. Like, it doesn't have to be a main character anymore. Exactly. It could be whatever the fuck. Right, because we're kind of run out, running out of, uh, like, big first-party main Nintendo characters to put in. Yeah. They have enough relevance, right? Like, we could go yeah. to like, Chibi-Robo, but, like, how many people would mm. recognize that? Fucking Is giant... Chibi Robo even... I... Chibi Robo's a Nintendo franchise? Premiered on oh. the GameCube, so... Oh, fair enough. Yeah. There's a 3DS. He has an Amiibo now. I don't know. I'm just thinking they need to games. get a from salt. If they're ever going to get a from software representative, it should be the main characters from Adventures of Cookie and Cream. <laughs> now that's a franchise I have not heard. <laughs> oh, ever man. since the Game Grumps episode of it, and that was when John was on the show. So that's how long ago I've heard of <laughs> Cookies and Cream. I heard about it from um, Stop Skeletons from Fighting, but yeah, it's it, it's a it's a treat. <laughs> it's a bizarre game. An interesting looking one, but bizarre nonetheless. It is. <laughs> it's the boys. best multiplayer game on the PlayStation 2. You can fuck. Um, God damn it. That one always throws me off. I can't quite get yeah. down. Exactly. You can jump that bitch, you know? <laughs> right. Then I'm worried about jumping into another boy. Yeah. Okay, fuck off. Okay, um, there we go. And then back I also up. Finally, <laughs> I also finally saw Ant-Man and the Wasp. Really? Like, last night. <laughs> How was it? Yeah. I'm not like that big into the Marvel movies, so I could care less <laughs> if it was good or not. Yeah. But... It's good. It's not as good as Infinity War, but I mean. Right. <laughs> I did like Infinity War when I saw it. Yeah. I couldn't tell you all the references and shit that was in that movie. Yeah. Fuck. Ugh. This is how they're gonna kill Thanos. They're gonna make him do the, tur the turbo tunnel. <laughs> His fat ass couldn't even fit through this. <laughs> He's too big. <laughs> He's too big. He'll hit a wall, like, immediately. It's not possible. Uh, oh, jeez. And this isn't even the worst ver worst uh, automated driving seg- oh, oh, hey, you made it. We're back. The worst automated driving segment in uh, Battletoads. Yeah, I've heard it. <laughs> that fucking game gets worse. You know what? Like, that, that might be, like, a, a life goal, is to one day beat Battletoads, but I'll have to wait until, like, I'm in my 40s before I even <laughs> properly attempt it. <laughs> You gotta, you gotta learn the ways of the NES. <laughs> exactly. Closest hard NES game I came to beating was Castlevania, and that took like a whole fucking night. <laughs> yeah. Um, and some luck. Castlevania isn't even that hard compared to some of these. Yeah. I'm looking at you, Castlevania 3. And you to, dick. Be, to be fair to this section in particular, it's not nearly as bad as the actual Turbo Tunnel. Uh, we came to find out that. It, it lovingly recreates it. It doesn't put in all the bullshit parts of it. No, it's still no, fucking not hard. at all. <laughs> it's still um, really hard. But yeah, chapter nine is or level nine in that game is a nut in Battletoads. Sorry, about my mic is another automated race segment, and um, not only is it more difficult because it requires a bunch because it's got a bunch of nine. But for added bonus, it is completely unbeatable if you're playing two-player. Great. <laughs> Fantastic. You know, like, part of the appeal of that game. It's just like, yeah. no, you can't even beat it. That's why some, That's why the, it's possible to get ROM ha uh, um, glitch fix on max, I guess is the term. Sure. Yeah. Um, I, you didn't refill your Icor, did you? I'm gonna check if I have one. I don't think I do. Eh, I have, God. I have. I have invincibility. It looks like the other one might be full. Nope. Nope. We've got invincibility and the phase locket. I'm about to fucking use it too. Forgot which yeah, button it was. <laughs> okay, I'm oh, gonna no. use it now. All right, here we go. <laughs> yeah, we got here, the phase ass. locket too. So. Okay, one more hit. One more hit. One more hit. One more hit. Come here. Come here. Come here. And then yeah. You just your ass. <laughs> Yes. Okay. Now, once you get to this dude, it's actually a lot easier than the turbo tunnel bit. <laughs> yeah, the, the first toad is fine when you're, like, going down the, the hall, and this one's fine. It's just that second one. Fucking yeah, Pimple. That fucker. <laughs> I don't asshole. know if it is or not. <laughs> Pimple's the, the brown one, I think, so. Wow, Shovel Knight, you've got some crazy moves. All right. Just keep his accent straight. Thank you, kind sirs. <laughs> 
Well, all this turbo training was draining. We ought to bug out and find some grub. Care to join us, shovel guy? Uh, I'll pass. Thank you. Your loss. Oh, hey, come meet us back at camp, though. We want to give you a little token of toad gratitude. For what? <laughs> what did we do? Other than we did suffer. not help them with anything. <laughs> Why are they giving us a token of gratitude? I guess they That's know the bullshit we went through. <laughs> yeah. Most righteous, shovel bro. We hereby name you an honor. Oh, sorry. I got the wrong inflection. Most righteous, shovel bro. We hereby name you an honorary toad. Turning into Ted. Um, <laughs> to aid you in your battle against your own dark queen. We bestow upon you this most excellent toad. This is Ted. This, is this guy's Ted. literally Ted. Yeah, yeah. We bestow upon you this most excellent toad gear. Now you'll have cool moves just like us. Want to equip the toad gear? Yes, please. Nice, you'll look stylish. I'm green with envy. Have fun with those smash hits. You bet, fam. Toad gear, brawl and you smash hits. Double tap, or you can run. So we got this goofy-ass run. <laughs> yeah. And then, uh, hold on. We got we go rapid down. fire, big toe, big shovel. Yeah, a little bit of, a little bit of that. Yeah, this might actually have been helpful on the final boss or something. <laughs> sure, and that's what we ended up finding out through this, is this profile never did finish the game. Um, yeah. But you can still do this, which is great. All you have to do is go through the Hall of Champions and do that one part, and you've unlocked it. And you can do it as soon as you get to the Hall of Champions, so. Let's talk to everybody. What's happening, honorary... Oh, you go ahead. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> What's happening, honorary toe? We were just about to try strike a totally awesome pose. Get in on this. Okay. I don't think we saw this last time. This is cool. No, we didn't. What? The bass? <laughs> <laughs> That's great. That's amazing. <laughs> I wonder if it's a different pose. Let me try it again. Oh, it is. What? Oh, no. I love this. <laughs> he disappears. <laughs> oh, I'm going to do that again. Oh, man. Please tell me there's more. Please tell me there's more. I don't think so. This seemed to only be the two. Oh, nope. <laughs> hey, squad. Well, I'm expecting Rise to come out of nowhere and fuck shit up. Okay, I'll stop. <laughs> That's really cool. <laughs> we didn't see that last time. That's great. No, we didn't. We didn't talk to any of these dudes last. Uh, no. No. I'm keeping it. What about you? <laughs> oh, you are out your oh. mind. Oh. You are out of your mind. Cover, uh, jet fuel. No. No. I mean, we could. I don't think we... No. See what we get as a reward. Probably just significant amounts of money. Those bikes will burn. <laughs> oh, I didn't mean to talk to you again. No, no, no. Go away. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa these, guys... <laughs> these guys are back in maximum attitude. The spikes, the outfits, extreme. Please, teach the bears. By you, Reese. I didn't mean to talk to you again. You're so big. Okay. Reese, you're an idiot. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's the long and short of that. Reese is an idiot. Yeah. And it gets even worse if you've played some of the other modes. And what's up here? A little secret boy. We got Chicken Man. Chicken. I say this airship rivals the Aerial Anvil and Tone Vet. Advanced. Who is the proprietor? Greetings, fellow bird nerd. Ah, yes, the vulture is my finest creation. For any of you looking for a Professor T. Bird cameo, there it is. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, hey, we should join these guys. And then we'd call you Battle Toter. Mm. Uh, <laughs> time for puns. You got another one, I assume. Face to oh, face. Oh, got like five. With the Battle Toads? What a rare opportunity, eh? Uh, I like that. I, I like that one more. Uh, you see, Shovel Knight's new toe gear looks like he got it out of punch. Okay. God. <laughs> We're moving on. And Toter is just not having any of it. He is. Toter never has any of it. He is displeased. And then I believe. So are we sure we don't want to try the toe? Yeah, that's everything. Yeah, I'm not you sure. Sure we don't want to try the toe? You sure? <laughs> that turbo tunnel can go fuck off. That's the. <laughs> by far He's the hardest none part. Of it. Whew. Okay. But yeah, you can also go back to just the regular old um, armor shop to 
get your new armor so or to change out your armor set there, so. Right. So we can I forgot here. Go yeah. Armor outpost. Remember it's the dude on the right. <laughs> I thought about it. I thought about it. <laughs> we can't actually buy another one. Oh, we are this is a different profile, I forgot. We we need yeah. to buy the this. I'm gonna do the uh yeah. We'll do the cool black one, might as well. I don't think we got the it. Bale of momentum! I don't think we actually showed it off, so. It yeah. does look pretty slick. Look at us. We look cool boys. Like almost like Black Knight. That's dope. Yeah! Awesome. Well, is there anything else we gotta do? We, we good. We good. Cool. Unless we. Yeah. But that'll do it for this episode. Hope you enjoyed the bonus episode. Kyle, where can they find you at? Uh, they can find me at live for the asylum at youtube.com um, Basilisk ST on Twitch on the rare occasions that I stream for fun and profit on WordPress um, Lions Honor Gaming at Lions Honor Gaming at YouTube <laughs> Wow <laughs> And I still need to get the dancing heads from Zach uh, And at standingtrials.com if you want to do creative writing in a sort of multiplayer text game. He also occasionally streams on Twitch as well. Whenever you I do. said that. It's good. I don't know. I, you forgot it last time, so I figured I'd bring it up. Yeah, yeah, that's fair. That's why. I, I don't know. This whole bonus episode was weird. We already did this at like three a.m. <laughs> so it just it just feels. feels and now we're awake and we don't know what to say. <laughs> exactly. We we were more put together during the first day. <laughs> three a.m. Than we are now. You know what? Fuck Watch it. it. We got it recorded. We got it done. If you guys liked the episode, be sure to leave a like. If you're new here, be sure to subscribe. Now that I finished another one of these series, I'll have more series coming to an end very shortly before the year is out. I mean, Blue Catch Productions, and I'm signing off. Bye bye. See ya.